isn't it lovely to just sit down and take it all in for a few minutes, Cuba Steve? I know we've been super busy, there's been so much going on, but I just wanted to relax, you know, sit down beside our mid dragon and just have a little look out. What? You're what? ruining my view. What, what, what's, hold on, what's up with the chair? Uh, yeah, I brought a chair out to sit down, look, because he's nice and chill, he's sitting down, he's ecstatic, he's full, <laughs> everything's, everything's going good. Everything's going good so far. So, I decided to just take a minute, Scuba Steve, you know? It's nice to take a minute every now and then. Step back, have a look at everything around you. Everything you've got instead of everything that you want, you know? Obviously, we want our dragons back. We want the Fire Nation to disappear. We want the Shadow Nation to disappear. But sometimes it's nice to just be like, look, all of our dragons that are here are happy. Oh, ooh, I think we've got a delivery, Scuba Steve. Ooh, I wonder what it is. Cookies. I'm thinking. Oh, uh, what? No. Okay. What, what are you talking about, cookies? Of course, it is not cookies. It is our mid dragons that we've been waiting for. Our obsidian mid dragons. Check out. How, like, if imagine they were real, how scary that would be. Don't they look so cool? They look awesome. Where? Okay. What? Hey, hold on a second. Hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. One, two, three, four. This isn't enough. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, no, that's not all of them, ma'am. Hello. Got um, everyone wrong. I, I don't think all of them are here. Uh, thank you so much for the delivery so far. These look really, really awesome, but we're definitely expecting a few more. Here is your delivery of dragon statues so far. If you wish to receive the rest, you must provide the obsidian, as the obsidian from the mine you provided has stopped coming. Hang on, I made a deal with that mine to deliver enough obsidian to finish off all of our dragons. It was, it's crazy, it was like 10,000 something obsidian and I had to pay them up front and they said they'll deliver all of the obsidian. Skipper Steve, have we been swindled? I feel like we've been hustled. Well, I don't I know. Think, I think those miners just didn't do the, do, do the job maybe? Or, or was it the sculptor? No, it definitely wasn't the sculptor guy. No. He seemed he seemed okay about it. It was the it was the, the guys that were supposed to give us the obsidian. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to go pay them a visit because I, they've obviously delivered some because we've seven dragons here, but we're missing eight dragons. So, uh, you know what, Mister uh, Sculptor's Apprentice, you go tell him that to, not to worry. The obsidian will be there, and we will require the remaining eight dragons. So, not to hang up his chisel yet, and be be ready. We're we'll gonna sort this out. We gotta go to the mines, Cuba Steve. We gotta go to the mine and make sure that uh, our order is still underway. You know what, Stardust? It's been a while. It has been a while. Have that. Get your energy up. You're coming with me. And uh, Scuba Steve, you're taking Fluffy? I'm taking Fluffy? All right. Yes, indeed. Perfect. Let's go. All right, Scuba Steve. This is the place. Now, I don't know if we want to run like a good cop, bad cop kind of thing or something. Uh, let's just see what they have to say for themselves because there's no reason our order should not be processed by now. I don't understand. Um, oh, yeah, so it's the Burdener Mining Co. All visitors must check in with Head Miner before entering the mines or the quarry. If you are injured in any way during your visit, Burdener Mining Co. accepts zero responsibility. Sounds about that, right. That is... That is good. That is that is smart business. I like the name of this company too. And so they sound pretty professional, but I'm thinking what we do is I'm thinking good cop, bad cop. I think that's the best. So you do bad cop. And I and just good start cup. shouting. You're you I don't think you're able to do good cop. No no you do, no, listen, I got this, okay? I got this, I've been working on it real hard. <laughs> okay, so let's just let's just stick with it. Okay, okay, you might have to hold it. Let's see what he has to say first. Because if he just says, "Ah, I haven't got to your order," then we'll do good cop, bad cop. But if he, okay. I don't know, he might have a reason for it. But this is the head miner in here that we're meant to check in with. Um, <clears throat> uh, uh, excuse me, excuse me. Hello. Uh, I've recently put in an order for uh, like 10,500 obsidian blocks to be delivered to the Arabian Kingdom for the sculptor and uh, I think like half of it has been delivered so far but it seems that the obsidian has dried up. Do you have an explanation for this? The men, they won't mine. There has been something down in the mines terrorizing them. 
A few of them have even gone missing. I have run this mine for over 10 years and have two golden pickaxe awards. If I don't get them back working soon, I'll be laughing stock of the mining industry. Feel free to talk to the men to see what's happening. Maybe if you can get them back in the mines, I can get your obsidian. Free of charge. Ooh. Hey, you listen up, buddy. That's not good enough. Me and my friend here, we ordered stuff and we want it now. Yeah. Did you like that? That was a bit that late. Was bad, you were meant to do big, good. Big. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you for the information. Follow me, uh, Skiver Steve. I thought we were doing bad cop, bad cop. You, <laughs> you were meant to That's be good cop, bad. but he already explained everything. Oh, okay. He really wants to get this problem sorted too. So let's go check out the mines and see what. Yeah, up. Did, I don't know if I overheard him or anything like that. But did he say that there's something in the mines? Uh, he said the he think the men think there is. I mean, they're all just chilling out up there. I, they're definitely not working. Uh, Do some work. There's a few no, people a, here. No. Let's let's maybe check with this guy. Excuse me, excuse me. What uh, seems to be the problem? Why are the miners on strike? Why aren't you in the mines mining the obsidian? I have a big order that I need. There's something down there, burrowing through the ground, chewing it up like it's nothing. I saw it swallow one of the workers whole without stopping to chew, like a big ferocious worm, angry that we are taking the obsidian from the earth. Ooh, I see, I see. Uh, is there anything that, I don't know. Obviously you see, you say you saw it swallow the workers whole. I mean, what did it look like? Did it have any specific features? The teeth, the teeth were huge, like ice peaks. Each one of them, and there were lots. Ooh, that's kind of scary. Wow, that's so much obsidian. Yeah, it's really deep down there. Um, seven, the seven or eight um, mid dragons we have is good enough for now. So nothing we can do here. So let's just call it a day. Get the rubies and go home. Uh, no, Skipper Steve, that is not gonna work because we need way more defense than seven dragons. I mean, fifteen oh. would be so much better. Um, let me yeah, just have you're a right. I'm look just, around. I'm just afraid. Yeah, I mean, I, I get it. Somebody. I get you, I get you, but uh, it's hard to see because it's all obsidian down there. I would not like to work in these mines because that would be so tough to mine through. You know how long it takes to mine obsidian and look at all of this. It's crazy. There's so much of it. All right. Um, I think we're going to have to go in. We're going to have to go in. Okay, so he said burrowing through the ground, chewing it up like it was nothing. Um, huge spiky teeth like ice picks. Does that ring a bell? Something that burrows through the ground with spiky burrows teeth, the eats ground. the ground up. Um, I'm gonna go down. Uh, it couldn't be a- hold on. It could be a dragon? Uh, nah. a dragon that burrows through the ground. It's ringing a bell, but I can't really spiky think. Teeth. What could it be, spiky? Wait, Scuba Steve! Don't go, don't go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't go further. What is it? I can't really see, but the dragon the thing he's describing sounds a lot like a screaming death and you know when screaming deaths are angry that they are no fun they just want to eat uh -oh. us up they have huge spiky teeth and they eat up ground and burrow through okay yeah that's that's a screaming death where, uh, where, can okay. you see? where are you i've lost you okay wait wait i'm up the top i'm up the top see no wonder okay oh here over here oh, yeah, for all right i'm gonna see if i can get back up here is this a this a way back up okay yeah, there's a rope here Okay, Scuba Steve, let's get out of here for yep. a second and make a plan, all right? Let me think. Okay. If it is a screaming death, then I know what to do, okay? So, because they are, it, well, it depends how old it is. If it is a young enough screaming death, it is attracted to light. But Ooh, if it's okay. older, it kind of loses that attraction. So, hmm, maybe because they opened up these, then it could see the daylight. And it was coming for it. Yeah. Maybe that's why it's here. Okay, have a quick look uh, in the pits. I think, it, uh, See I think it might be new. You think it could be young? Yeah, a, a new young one because it kind of makes sense. I mean, they've been mining here for a long time by the looks of things and they never had this problem before, so. Yeah, it could have new. hatched because, yeah, it could have hatched while they were doing it. Okay, um, I can't see. Whoa! Oh, okay, yeah, it's definitely a screaming death. It's down there. What? It's in, it's in the furthest pit back. 
Okay, that's it not good. Us. It didn't see us. Okay, we need to come up with some sort of plan. I have an idea. I have an idea. Okay. Hit so, we're gonna need a huge light source, and we're gonna have to put it in the furthest pit down this way. Okay? So, okay. yeah, near the, the pit you're at. So, if we put the huge light source in here, switch it yeah. on, the screaming that should come from that, la that last pit, through this pit, and into mm -hmm. this pit. And then we can drop like a cage, and it will trap it in there, and then the miners can continue working with these two, and we'll figure out what to do with the screaming death. Oh yeah, that is good. Oh, maybe we can add the Screaming Death to our Dragon Army. Yeah, well, we do have two, and they have just kind of been probably burrowing around. I, it's been a while since I've seen them, because since we moved to the nation, obviously so much has happened. So they're on the list as well, though, that we need to find and figure out. I don't know if the Fire Nation took them, but... Okay, we've got this one to deal with. So let's get the trap set and see if it works. All right, Scuba Steve, that looks really, really good. I think that will do the job. Because Screaming Deaths are so sensitive to light. That's why usually they just stay underground. Well, Whispering Deaths can't actually look at light. But Screaming Deaths, they're attracted to it. So, hopefully they can see this. Or he can... Oh, there might be more than one. I didn't even think of that. Okay, hopefully he sees this, moves into this crater, and we can block it off. That's the best bet. So, uh, no sign of him yet. We might actually need to trickle some light in through this one. Just to get him into the middle one and then once he's in the middle one he should be able to see that and go straight for that one oh this is a really good plan this is definitely gonna work oh i can't believe it's working oh, look, he's like curled up around it and just like holding on to the light source they really really like that it must be such a young screaming death but it is perfect okay it's trapped in there now scuba steve so, miners, you can get working on the other two mines, and then we can figure out what to do with it later. Once it's trapped, it's okay. It's safe for everybody else. But, uh, aren't these guys lucky that we're such dragon experts? We know what it wants and what it's here for? Because these guys would have just been like, Ah, it's just here to kill us! But it's not. It's looking for light. So... Yeah, everybody thinks that dragons just want to eat them. And, yeah, a lot of dragons, they want to eat you, but not that dragon. Well, that dragon did probably he want to does. eat all those yeah, people. Yeah, he did eat some people. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, perfect. Um, Mr. Foreman, the Screaming Death is captured in the first mine. So make sure you do not uh, go in there. But your miners should be good to go on the other two. Your order will be delivered ASAP. Thank you once again. And of course, your order is now free. That's perfect. Thank you. We have a lot of business to attend to. So we shall move on. But thank you. All right. Yeah, and this better not happen again. You don't want me coming back around here. So I don't want to... Are we doing the thing? Uh, no. But if you want to, I mean... I mean, we got it for free, right? We got it for free, so I wouldn't I wouldn't keep bothering him. He might change his mind on that. Yeah, that's true. Um, okay, so that's it. So we got all that for free. So what's next? We got to go get the rubies enchanted. So it's off to the mages to see if they will do it. What do you think? Ooh, that is gonna be fun. I don't think I've ever met this mage before. Uh, have I? I can't remember if I have. I don't think so, but the Dragon Scout knows where the guild is, so let's get going. All right, Scuba Steve, this is the place. Now be on your best behavior. Ooh, so no, no bad cop this time. No bad cop, no good cop, no cop. There's no cop here, okay? So just best behavior is all we need. Just a little cop. No cop. Little, little, little cop. No cop? No. Okay, no cop. No, not one cop. Like, zero okay. cop. Yeah, because I don't think these guys would be as nice or as tolerant as the uh, the mining guys, right? No, and I'm pretty sure he'll just turn you into a frog anyway, so if you are uh, a bit mean. I, I, We need to find, like, the head guy. There's so many bewilder beasts around. These guys must have, like, serious magic power. It's crazy. Mm, or maybe... The bewilderbeasts aren't bewilderbeasts. They're like... Oh, they're not even real? Well, on. They're just like illusions to create security? Oh, yeah, they could be illusions as well. Look. It's like they're surrounding the place. All right, I need to find... Yeah, there's no, nobody has that many bewilderbeasts. No, it's pretty insane. It's uh... an illusion. It's a spell. Okay, how do we... Okay, this place is like a maze. Yeah, it Did is. You we're say... back in the front. <laughs> we're, going, we're going to the mage or going to the maze? The mage. 
The mage. Definitely the mage. Okay. A bit like a maze. Oh, here's right. stairs. Stairs. Follow me. Yeah, stairs. We gotta go find the head mage. Uh, where could it be? All these guys, they're like elves and stuff as well, which is really cool. Yeah. Okay, I'm getting somewhere. I'm upstairs. Oh, maybe we can go up again. I'm upstairs. Oh, there you are. I'm behind you. How'd you get up in front of me? Ooh. Look at this place. This wow. looks like it. Ooh, oh, look, free, free eggs, free eggs. No, just give me Steve. Grab him, grab him, grab him. Do not touch. Oh, I'm in the water. Just give me Steve. <clears throat> excuse me, excuse me, head wizard. Hi, uh, wait, don't mind my friend. Yeah, he's a scuba diver, so he just can't resist himself jumping in the water. But uh, we are here. We're looking for a mage who can enchant some rubies for us because we need to bring some dragons to life. You see, it's a, it's a bit of a complicated story, but do you think you could do that? How am I to know that you will not use these dragons for evil? Oh, well, no, they're more for defense and security against the Fire Nation. The Fire Nation attacked my nation, stole all my dragons. We managed to get some back, but not all. So they know where I am. I just need more security. And these myth dragons, these obsidian dragons, are the strongest that I've seen. So they are going to defend us. And maybe if we can, like, launch a raid on the Fire Nation. Fire Nation are evil anyway. They, they're, they're so bad. You shouldn't worry about them. I see. Well, I'm afraid it is not that simple. If we were to enchant rubies that brings bring dragons to life for everyone who came in here, then the world would be a very dangerous place. Much more dangerous than it already is. You will need to bring me some sort of proof that these dragons will be used for good. Then we may enchant your rubies. Oh, okay. I can try. I mean, what kind of proof? I don't really know what we could, we could do. Excuse me, Steve. Are you talking to the girls? Yeah, yeah, I was telling her story, the bad cop story. Oh, she loves oh, it. Yeah. She's loving it, by the way. Yeah, okay. she's loving it. These are weird symbols. Yeah, they're like, I don't know, like purple birds? Purple dragons. Purp oh, purple dragons, maybe. Okay, well, thank you for your time, um, head mage. We, we'll try to figure this out ourselves. Uh, excuse me, Steve, what are we going to do? Yeah, so basically, it was like, so I said I'd be bad cop. I know, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, hey, what's up? What are you? I'm so sorry for I'm my sorry. friend here talking to you. Uh, we'll be on our way. We were just, we were just uh, asking the head mage for a favor. I couldn't help but overhear your conversation. I too have experience with the Fire Nation. They stole my father's dragons, and I'd do anything to get back at them. I believe you will put these dragons to good use fighting against the Fire Nation, so I can help you with your rubies. Come back after nightfall and find me in the library. I will enchant them there, but don't let anyone know about it. Okay, that's perfect. <gasps> that's perfect. We'll be back. Oh, skip it, Steve. Good job. Yeah, I know. I told you. See all my, my flirting. The women, they just can't resist me. The ladies love me. Uh, I don't think that was it. I think it was more about getting revenge on the Fire Nation and because they stole her father's dragons and stuff. But yeah, yeah, sure. Like, if you want. Yeah, no, she's just, she's just, she's just saying that because she's shy. But yeah, no, um, that was all because of me. But that's awesome. So the 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 main mage doesn't like us, but she likes us. Uh oh! Oh, the bewildered beasts are shooting at us. Get out of here! Yeah, they like us. We gotta go. Yeah, we'll come back at night. 